this is the Steel Series Arctis Nova 7. And in this video, I'm gonna give you my review and my experience on using it for the past few days and if this is the headset for you. Hey everybody, if we're meeting for the first time, my name is Swaldo and a huge thank you to EveTech for sending these over for me to give you my personal opinion on it. Now this is my very first ever pair of wireless headphones but in summary over the past few days all I can say is it's going to be so hard to say goodbye to these pair of headphones. Whoever is getting these as Eve Tech and I are running a giveaway to give this exact pair away you guys are going to be blessed. It is absolutely amazing. The sound quality ooh. now just to quickly run you through what's all in the box with this, I am gonna be playing my unboxing on the side over here somewhere, one of these two sides, just for you to see. But it does come in USB-C, but it does have an adapter if you wanna use a USB into your computer. And from there, you'll be able to easily pair it just using the Bluetooth button. It has about 38 hour battery life. All I can say is for me, it's lasted longer than 38 hours, which I, I mean, I ain't gonna be complaining about that. It does also have a fast charge feature, which means for every 15 minutes you charge this thing up, you're going to get about six hours of gaming life from it. Now the quality of this headset, one thing I really love about it is it doesn't feel cheap. I'm feeling around you, it doesn't feel like Plastic. I used to use the Corsair Void 7.1. It wasn't wireless. And that had a very plasticky feel. Whereas feeling this, it feels sturdy. It feels really good. The cups over here, they're so comfortable. I wore this thing, I was playing about Cyberpunk for about maybe eight hours straight, played some Modern Warfare 2. I didn't once feel any uh, irritation with my ears. It didn't feel like you know, when you're driving high on the mountain, you get those ear blocks. I didn't get any of those, which I used to get with my Corsair Void. And overall, the, comf the how comfortable this pair of headphones is, is absolutely insane. Uh, you're definitely gonna be, be racking in quite a few hours with this. If you're going for a grind, uh, this is your pair of headsets. <laughs> This is your pair of headphones right here for you. Uh, I'm, I'm so sad I have to say goodbye to these things. They're so amazing. <laughs> Some favorite features on there is you have two volume bars over here. Now the one is going to be for your in-game volume. So if you need to turn down your music or when you turn down how loud the game is playing. Now the other one is through, you can configure it through the SteelSeries app how loud you're gonna hear people back in Discord, which is freaking cool if you need to make them softer in those clutch or kick rounds, or if you need to turn them up because you have that one teammate that's just so freaking soft all of the time. That's freaking cool. You just have a mute button over here. And all I can say guys is pressing these things in, it doesn't feel cheap, which I really like. Now let's quickly talk about aesthetic. Aesthetic to me is very important. Now, maybe you're like me and you're like all black. For me, getting this matte black is absolutely, oh, this, just, this is just my vibe. I'm a Wednesday vibe. What are you guys? Now it does also have an elastic headband. Now this, you can actually adjust how high or low it is. And this just helps it to rest really nicely on your head. It also has a really nice cool pattern on the inside. I will make sure that the B-roll gets the close-ups of it so that it does it justice. But overall, quality and aesthetic for me, this is definitely a 10 out of 10 for me. Now onto the microphone. So the microphone is retractable, meaning that you get to pull it out over here like this, or you can push it back in when you're not using it. For me, I personally would not use this microphone. Uh, if you have access to a USB mic, I preach USB microphones, so you can check out my channel for that. But with this coming out here, it is quite nice. It's not all up in your face. You can move it around your mouth, but uh, let's not do that. We don't We don't want to be that friend that uh, that is, uh, you know, chewing <laughs> ASMR in Discord. But let's do a quick mic test. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. A pick of pickled peppers, Peter Piper picked. If Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, Where's the pick of pickled peppers Peter Piper picked? So this is how it's gonna sound out of the box without any fine tuning at all. I actually want I'm just curious if I run it through some of my personal filters, how it's gonna sound. So let me quickly enable these. Okay, so let's test this out. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. A peck of pickled peppers. Peter Piper picked pecked. If Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers, I, I can't say these things anymore. These tongue twisters get me every single time. 
but this is how it's going to be sounding with some of my personal filters that I use on the Shure MV7. So I hope it makes a difference. I mean, I'll see now while I'm editing. Hi, editing Joe. So now onto the pros and the cons of this headset. It is running simultaneous wireless 2.4 gigahertz. It has Bluetooth, which is obviously making it wireless. It's super, super freaking comfortable. It has fast charging. Uh, pretty much more than 38 hours for me of battery life, which is really awesome. You have the almighty audio, which is the best in-class audio for gaming with high fidelity drivers as well. 360 degree spatial audio. Actually, on that pause over there, I was actually playing some Modern Warfare 2 since it was free to play this weekend and I could hear the footsteps everywhere. I could pinpoint exactly where the enemy was and I was really really impressed with that in counter-strike as well i could pinpoint from a long that someone was up short on a side already if you play counter-strike you'll know that's pretty impressive but they were running around around like an elephant it has dual audio streams which means that you get to mix two audio connections at the same time then you chat with friends while gaming play with lag free as well as use, utilizing the 2.4 gigahertz of the bluetooth there's multi-platform support which means you get to use it on pc mac and playstation as well as the switch which is freaking cool it does now it has ai powered noise cancellation which you're gonna have to download the steel series gg engine app which is free and it's easy to download and set that up on your pc and you can fine tune it even further and it's also adjustable so you can just pull this out gently over here and you'll see it just to just extends or you can push it back in i have a very tiny head by the way so i keep this thing as small as possible now that our audio test is done i wanted to run you through some cons there are a few shortfalls maybe actually just one that i have and it is a little bit nitpicky of me because i'm currently using jbl earbuds now for some reason those jbl earbuds are amazing the bass in there so the bass that I get from this is a little bit of a disappointment. There is bass, but it doesn't live up to the expectation I had for the price of these headphones. That is just something you're going to keep in mind. And I'm sure there's an app out there that you can use to bass boost the hell out of these things. Other than that, I would give this thing a must buy. The convenience of it being wireless, being able to take a poop and know that you found a game on Counter-Strike, being able to go to the kitchen and uh, make yourself a cup of coffee and listen to people smack talking at how bad you are at Modern Warfare 2. It's absolutely amazing. I mean, not a disappointment at all for me personally hearing them smack talk, but otherwise, the aesthetic, the quality of the material, the sound quality I get when I'm listening specifically to music as well is amazing. So guys, Go grab yourself a pair of these if it fits into your budget. If you're looking for a good pair of wireless headphones, you're not going to be disappointed. And a huge thank you to EveTech for sending these over to me. And if you would like to enter the giveaway, the link is in the description.